Hey, it's Craig Shimei from ClearStarMedia.com, and today we are talking about YouTube for Expert Village. Now, I am in no way affiliated with YouTube or the people who work there who put out a great site for you to be able to put your video on there. But I'm somebody who's used the site and have a background in production and like to maybe help you out a little bit if you've never really explored YouTube. It's a great site just to go to and watch videos and be able to see what people do. Um, different shows maybe might be on there and a lot of different uh, exciting clips that will really make you laugh or maybe make you cry or just be downright uh, disgusted. But anyways, how do you get your clip on there? Well, I showed you in the last segment, go ahead and make your account. And, and it's very simple. The first thing you want to do is click this button right at the top here it says upload. Now, where do you get the clips from? Well, for example, I use uh, this camera here. And the nice thing about this camera, and I'm sure you all have digital cameras like this, they are now coming with the ability to record audio. So what I do is I go ahead and I go into my video mode. I record some video. It puts it in a format that I'm able to use on YouTube. Now, the one thing you need to look at, you need to look at your file size. It can't be more than 100 megabytes. And I know that sounds like a lot, but with video, it goes real quick. On top of it not being more than 100 megabytes, you want to make sure it's not longer than 10 minutes. Now, there is ways to get around the 10 minute marker on YouTube, which I can tell you about later. But right now, if you're just uploading stuff, it needs to be under 10 minutes and it needs to be under 100 megabytes. And it needs to be in a file format that the uh, YouTube recognizes. For example, like an MOV, a WMV file, an AVI, or even an MPEG file. Those are the most common used files for YouTube. So let's say we go ahead and we get in here. And uh, the you, first thing you need to do is title your clip. This is so people can uh, know what it's called. I'm going to call this one Paris Hilton. Why? Because I have a clip here where we saw Paris Hilton when we were out shopping. I can describe it any way I w that I was. Uh, Paris comes uh, out uh, comes out of uh, a salon. Okay. I know my spelling and is not. Uh, is not the greatest. Now tag, this is very important. This is how people are gonna find this video. So you wanna put as many tags in. Now for the sake of time, I'm not gonna do that. I would of course write in Paris space Hilton. Uh, I would of course write in um, celebrity. You know, you may wanna write in celebrity in there so that people know how to look it up. And any other things that you think would people, would wanna come and see your video. Next thing you wanna categorize it. What is this? Well, I think it could be maybe entertainment or it might be people. So I'm going to go ahead and put it in under people. Now broadcast options, very important. Is this something that you only want to share with 25 of your friends or is this something you want everybody on YouTube to see? Most of the time you do, so you would keep that as public. The next thing you do is you don't need to really do this, the date and map options. That's in case you want to show where you live and all that fun stuff. And it's, it's really a fun little tool. And then sharing options allow uh, people to put video responses and things of that nature. Next thing you do is use click upload video. This is very, very simple. You browse. You need to know where you have your video saved on your computer. Now, I know that my video is saved in this little shared folder. Click open. I see it there. The next thing I do is... I've got this MPEG video ready to go. Click upload, and that's it. From there, YouTube will take your video from an AVI or whatever format you have and turn it into a flash piece of video. I'll tell you what flash is in the next segment, and we'll look at how easily this thing got uploaded.